Everybody, unhappy homebrew Wednesday. Last weekend, I heard of the untimely passing of Paul Wicksteed. Um, I was devastated. I actually couldn't believe it. Um, I almost wanted to think it was a joke or something. Obviously, it's not. Um, terrible loss to his family, to the homebrew brew tube community, and probably to everybody who um, crossed paths with him uh, in life. Um, I never met him, but um, I could tell he was a really good guy, um, uber passionate about uh, all things beer, and um, it's really a tragedy. Uh, so I'd like to toast. Cheers, Paul. I never met Paul, but um, when he came here, unfortunately, in retrospect, I probably should have um, tried to meet with him. Um, never met him, but um, when he did come here uh, to the United States, I guess two summers ago, um, I offered to let him stay at my place. Uh, he graciously declined. Um, he was meeting with uh, SJ and some of the other brew tubers, but. I figured he was going to come to New York City, but he had other plans. A um, couple things uh, that struck me. Well, how did I get to start seeing Paul? Um, probably about two and a half years ago, I guess. Uh, I was getting a little played out with TV, so I started messing around with YouTube. I've always been into home brewing. Um, stumbled upon uh, the brew tubers, the homebrew Wednesday concept. Um, I guess probably Craig Tube and Time for Another and uh, Little Face Brewing SJ's channel and uh, maybe one or two others were some of the first that I started seeing. Um, and I have to say, um, polls uh, were some of the, the best videos. I thought it was like it's like, why was I watching TV? I might as well be watching this stuff and the others as well. Um, it was so entertaining. I mean, the guy's passion just went right through and you could tell this is a guy who was passionate about beer. A um, couple things I really liked about his particular um, channel. First things first, whenever he opened a beer and he did the the crack like that, I actually thought at first he was ripping the cap off the beer. Um, I didn't realize until after he had the bottle opener on his finger, which I thought was crazy cool. I even tried to get one at the local homebrew shop. Um, I think I messaged at the bottom of one of his videos, I messaged like, that is so impressive. I can't believe how strong you are ripping the cap off. And then he said, you know, he explained about the um, uh, ring bottle opener. Anyway, I liked that. I liked how fluid his videos were, how well he spoke, how eloquent, how passionate. I liked the music in the videos. I loved the titling, MASH, Lauder, etc. I mean, it was just, it was done better than any TV I was watching at the time. Um, and uh, I'm going to truly miss that. Um, it's like to raise a glass. Toast. Mr. Wicksteed. Cheers. I don't have much more to say, but I hope in some way we can honor um, his memory. I know things are brewing. Um, it's very sad.